Well, welcome once again to another Face to Face with Rockosaurus. Today is my great pleasure to be talking to some guys called Gin Annie. Welcome. Hello. Hello. Good hello, evening. Hello. Welcome. Well, I think this is your first uh, first time at Leo's Red Lion, isn't it? This is our very first visit, and I must say, it is pretty damn cool. It is, isn't it? It is pretty damn cool. And this, if anyone doesn't know, the dressing room is a boxing ring. It's amazing. amazing. It's, in fact, it's a gym. Ever. It's not. Yeah, a it's a proper gym, isn't it? Yeah. So it never mind the venue. This is this is pretty fucking cool. Yeah, well, I know because you, you know if you if one of you pisses the other one off, you can always you know. That's what Hammer said before we went. He said any any like you know any problems in the band, we'll just sort it out now. Yeah, damn right. So we're all gonna yeah, kick, it's, we're it's all gonna kick the shit out of Hammer in there before we go on stage. That's a it's, thought. It's can, great can, to have Can we swear? Here, can we swear? Can we? Hey, of course you can fucking swear. Yeah, fucking swear. Yeah. It, it's great to see you guys here. I know the Rock Cooperative have been keen to get you here for a long time. Yeah, and sure. uh, yeah. the last have managed it. Uh, now, one question always springs to mind is, how did the name Gin Annie come about? So the original, the original place we rehearsed was at my parents' pub. And um, we were struggling for a name for the band. But finding a name for a band is one of the most difficult things you can mm. ever try and do. Um, and I came to rehearsal, and one of the guys in the pub um, he said, I've got a name for the band. And I was like, fire away. And he said, Gin Annie. And I was like, where's that come from? Yeah. And the original landlady at the pub was named Anne. Mm. And when she passed, her drink was gin. Yeah. She'd always have drink. And when she passed on, um, gin would go missing. Right. And they'd blame the ghost. Yeah. And they'd say, oh, that's Gin Annie. Brilliant. So that's where it came from. Excellent. And I thought it was that shit. It's yeah. good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's a unique name, isn't it? You it's know, unusual. It's, it's completely yeah. unusual. You would never think of that yourself. No. So, no. Yeah. I mean, let's face it. If you Googled it, yeah. you know, you might well, you might yeah. come up with some <laughs> strange stuff. But <laughs> <laughs> no, but it was nice to be given a name rather than try and figure it out because it is so difficult to yeah. find yes. a name. Yeah. yeah, that's interesting. You're not the only band who's named after a, a woman, actually. Yeah, I mean, for uh, sure. Um, I mean, Florence Black's a good example. Uh, yeah. yeah. I believe that was some old girl who delivered coal in there um, we go. In, in a village in Greta Wales. Van Fleet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Exactly. There you go. Yeah. yeah. No, but it. No, it All worked. the best bands are named after dead women. <laughs> 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 didn't call yourselves Mark and Thatcher. <laughs> no, <we didn't. laughs> be a good punk band. Yeah. Well, wouldn't it, it would yeah. be a really good punk band. <laughs> The Maggie Thatchers. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. Now, I've not had the pleasure of seeing you guys before. I don't think, um, I've seen a lot of bands, but I don't think you've been on, on my, my um, physical radar before. Sure. Looking forward to seeing you play. Um, how would you describe the, your, your style? <sighs> okay, style-wise. Um, it, it, it's so easy to be sort of pigeonholed and put in with... I want to do that. You know, so it's it, it easy to do that. But what we do is yes we base our music around good solid chunky classic rock riff mm -hmm. um the drums the good stomping drums the groovy bass that's what we do um but i suppose what we do differently as well is vocally and this is not me blowing my trumpet um you haven't got any we trumpets in the band. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're quite melodic yeah so what, what we always wanted to do was be able to understand the vocal because that for me is a big thing. Because there's a million bands out there, and Dave, it's like a running joke. We'll listen yeah. to a band, and Dave goes, "What's his song about?" Yeah, I yeah. Know, I have no idea. You can't pick anything out. No. And it's fine. It's like rock music's full of full of that, but that's not what we wanted to do. We wanted, yeah. and hopefully, well, you, you want to be able to tell a story, and for of course, to pretty much, it, yeah. pretty for much, people to understand what we're saying, and and more importantly, be able to sing along. Yeah, and it works that way. So what you get with us is you get a high energy, you get performance. And you just come away thinking, I've had a good fucking night. Yeah. yeah. And it's think, that simple. I think the thing as well is we always have a good time on stage as well. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. you know, pretty damned I, important. You, yeah. you know, live music, there's going to be a lot of fuck-ups. Yeah. And, and I've played in bands, I'm sure these guys have played in bands, when you make a mistake and you get the... You know, the evil, yeah. you, you played a G sharp instead of a fucking A or something. Yeah, you still get that now, don't oh, you? I'm sorry about that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we always look at Hammer when he does that. But no one can hear the bass anyway, so it's not important. And... Uh, He's going to fucking kill me. Um, <laughs> and, uh, Do you in the ring? <laughs> I think that ring's going to get used. <laughs> <laughs> but no, the, the, the thing is, is we, have, we have fun. We have yeah. fun. And um, what's, what's lovely is when we've done shows, 
and people have come up to us afterwards and said, you guys look like you're having so much fun. And that, just we are. that projects. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And it's like, how can you not have fun doing this? You well, know? that's so, right. And, and what, what's, what's kind of cute is, is there's a few in-jokes mm-hmm. with us on stage. Yeah. 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 Yeah, me and Beej will look at each other, or me and Dave will look at each other, and, and you know, there's, there's all those little in-jokes things. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, and it, it, it's just fun, you know, and, yeah. and to still be doing this is, is great, especially after the last two years. Well, so exactly. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's a joy to get back up on stage, isn't it? Yeah. Let's face it's it, you know. It, it's, it's a funny one, really, because it, it's kind of like, and I always feel this, I always feel like we're having people's pants down. And I know that sounds <laughs> that sounds really bad, so but, but what I was going to say, where are we going with this? Where are we going? Where are we going? Help, yeah. help, help. Edit, you know, edit. I like, I like where edit. we're going. Go, yeah. Keep keep going 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 going. Going. I got you. Yeah. You're saying that he's digging I'm, a bigger I'm, hole here. Yeah, it's got it's got to be wrong. He's basically saying he's going to be right. doing for free. It's what we love doing. Yeah. We get paid to do this. And to come somewhere we've never we've we've never been anywhere close to Kent or Gravesend before. Yeah. Um not only to play but as individual I don't think we've any of us have been here yeah. and to sell out a show mm. is, is just ace it's, oh yeah it's great it's great yeah. fun no I mean you, you know you've been sort of big on the you know the new wave of classic rock scene um, mm-hmm. you know, you've, your name's out there mm. you know so of course people are going to yeah. flock to see you yeah. um, and what you'll find here at Leo's is you know we get a great sort of uh, loyal crowd um, who will always come here sure um, Mm-hmm. Let's face it, we only have good bands on here. <laughs> yeah. you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. If you're no good, you don't get invited yeah, in the first place. Sure. You know, so, sure. um, um, like I say, Rock Cooperative have been after you guys for quite a while. Yeah. But uh, yeah. finally it's happened. It's good good. Yeah. Good things come to those who wait. Yes. Yeah. It's a compliment, though, isn't it? Ultimately, yeah. boys, it, yeah. it is a big compliment for us to, to be, to be asked to play. Yeah. Yeah. Where, yeah. From the bar. <laughs> it, 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 it's a pub, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. He's got, a lipstick, he's got lipstick on the glass as well. well. He has got lipstick on the glass, hasn't he? That's your show. Is that mine? Yeah. <laughs> no, no. We, I, could, I, could, okay. I can assure you it's Red Bull. <laughs> yeah. With vodka. Yeah. So, uh, coming back to the music, I mean, right. what would you say your main sort of influences are? In, um, Ooh, I'll tell you what. Know. I'll tell you what, then let's go. Let's go round, we go round and we'll go to each. Two major two. influences each. Two major yeah. influences each. Um... Brian? Are we starting with me? Uh, uh, f- from a, a guitarist. Bross and Abba. I was going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. cool. from, from a guitarist point of view, mm-hmm. uh, Randy Rhodes mm-hmm. and Jakey Lee. Yeah. From a band point of view, um, uh, there's a little bit of... Uh, I'm going to generalise. No, you've been uh, you're, you're prolonging uh, this. You've been prolonging long. Okay. There's a little bit of nope. Rush. Countdown mm-hmm. clock. And there's a little bit of... Oh, I just let it talk. And there's, uh, uh, I don't know, um, any any kind of uh, uh, late. Do you know 80s, the irony of saying there's a little bit of rush band. Band. Yeah. and then taking forever to oh, come no, out with yeah. the next bit? Yeah. Yeah. I know, yeah. Epic <laughs> songs, aren't they? Epic songs. Um, I, I would love to be horrible there and pick the things that Davey's going to say. Because I do know him that well, so I could now say <laughs> I'm influenced. And say these, and then Dave's going to panic and not be able to pick his own. <laughs> but um, no, I won't. Um, from a guitar perspective, I adore Slash. Yeah. Um, I adore guitar solos that you can sing back, mm. um, and uh, are as, just as important as in the song as anything else. Oh, definitely. Um, band-wise, my heart's always been with Metallica and stuff, but influences bleed through into the music that you write, but you write the music for the band. Yeah. So we'd all sit and write different songs if we were if we were left to our own devices, but we we write songs that suit you, Nanny. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. No, I'm with you. Yeah. David. Uh, um, bon Jovi and Blackstone Cherry and. <laughs> 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 no, on a serious note, I would say if I was going down the guitar route, I would hundred percent say Sambora, mm-hmm. and obviously Slash, yeah. which Byron's easily picked up on there. <laughs> yeah. Wanker. Um. But when it, when it really comes down to influences, I think, for me, you're looking Bon Jovi, you're looking the Beatles. Mm-hmm. But if I was going to talk anyone who really, really moulded it for me was Paul Rogers. Yeah. That's yeah. the man. Oh, yeah. yeah. Because yeah. this guy's in his 70s now, and, and to hear him sing, it is a, it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a masterclass. Well, that's right, yeah. Well, I mean, I saw Bad Company sort of, um, a few years ago, mm. and yeah. the guy has still got it. It's ridiculous. It's, it's crazy. It is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yeah, he started so young when you were all right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And he's singing that and he's so young at that point. Oh, no. It's obscene. Yeah. 
yeah, yeah. it's um, yeah, quite. This is where Louis Snow goes, Frank Zappa. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't actually going to say oh, that. No. I mean, I'm well, impressed he knows how to use a mic. He's, he's going. <laughs> I'm just checking I'm on the right channel. Because you said on your the right channel. channel You're on channel eight. Um, <laughs> I don't know. For me, I'd, I'd probably say it's like Led Zeppelin was my big one. Yeah. And yeah. the bottom tattoo hidden under the matching tracksuit. Uh, <laughs> 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 he's rock and roll tracksuit. Oh, to be fair, big truck's not feeling very well. Today. I've been, oh, yeah. I've been quite been ill. Ill. I've been quite ill. Um, so this is my comfy clothes. So he's coming in his pyjamas. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> 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 I'm like Aladdin on my magic coming. carpet yeah. in the form of a Ford Transit. Um, <laughs> yeah, for me, uh, Led shot. Zeppelin, big time. Yeah. Um, John Bonham all the way, that kind of stuff. Oh, yeah. uh, but then I do love like Rival Sons and that kind of newer phase newer of that stuff. kind of... Yeah. And you are a little bit obsessed yeah. with Frank Zappa. Oh yeah, I love Frank Zappa. He's, he's and the gone. more drunk he gets, the more he tries to convince us that we all like Frank Zappa, yeah. which we don't. <laughs> we, don't. <laughs> we all go through. He's like, no, but we all say we all say we don't like things until we try them. That's, that's all <laughs> yeah. I'm going to say. Very true. <laughs> that's yeah. <laughs> when have you sat down and listened to him? You haven't. No. You no, just no, assume. No. That's, that's I'll use your boyfriend's chat up lines on me. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's the same with me and Metallica. I just hate Metallica. Oh, <laughs> no, you don't. Shots shoot. fired. Shots oh, fired. Oh, here we go. Get in that ring, kid. Metallica's <laughs> last can't Get keep in that time. ring. Get in that ring. Because Lars can't keep time. Think about rings. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, Maybe Lars is my biggest invention. Yeah, it's, it's not good, a good we're idea. We're being mooned. We're being mooned at the moment. Here, here comes the new romantic. Get ready. Yeah, yeah so yeah. not new romantic, although oh. that's where my sort of musical influences started. But I've, I've probably had a different journey to these guys through really to where we're at. Up yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's been all through the eighties, you can't remember it. Yeah, <laughs> you know, um, you know, going it's a lot of the grunge from fans, from Yeah, yeah. Eighties sort of so you're going new romantic Japan. guys into grunge. But then, you know, mainly I don't listen to rock music much rock music now, I'm mainly into sort of dance music and, yeah. and techno. But anything that causes mayhem basically. Yeah. Oh, fair enough. Yeah. Yeah. This is us off. Yeah. 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 I like the electronic bagpipes of you. Like. <laughs> I'm into them at the moment. But these guys don't get it. So. Nah, I'll nah. get it somewhere. And the advert for the new bass player is going out next week. <laughs> <laughs> Good fucking look. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I think you're going to have a blast tonight. We will. Um, Yeah, you're going to you're going to have a great crowd. You you guys clearly enjoy what you do. Yeah, Um, I'm really looking forward to seeing you. And uh, thank you very much for taking a bit of time out to. No, thank you for having us. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot, guys. Cheers. Cheers.